welcome back to Advent of Ascension, everybody. This is going to be a solo episode, maybe. I don't know. I haven't really planned anything for this episode. But I want to do some fun and also want to explain some things here. So, uh, in this episode, I'm going to explain the creation uh, skill, which is, it's, I don't know. I didn't really use it too much. I mean, I used the comp here a couple times last season, and maybe I used the Corby. But uh, with all these skills, I think things that are... Things like slabs are getting really hard to use. Same thing with stabs. Like, you have to be certain levels to use stabs. So, you'd have to use extremely basic stabs until you leveled up all the way to, like, 70 to start using, like, actually, like, late game stabs. Like, you'd have to use this staff for a while. To get this staff, I need weather rune, wither runes and energy rune. Uh, I need wind runes, poison runes, storm runes. This is an item you can get, like, right when you start the game if you spawn in a jungle. But, I. Uh, you gotta level up a lot, but yeah, as you see, we got all these new, all these skills, two new ones right there, vitality and soul, soul something. I don't even know what that one is. Vitality, you level up by taking stuff out of a smelting furnace. It like, didn't really level up, probably because it's a modded furnace. Hey, runium chunks. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, let's throw these in here. But yeah, we can. What was that? I don't even remember what it was talking about. That soul thing, the blue one, I don't remember what it's called. I was reading up something about it. That is, you can level it up by breaking plants. Uh, in Saliv, Sel whatever it's called. I was breaking like the plants there, the trees there, and I picked up a couple drops for that skill. But creation, so, uh, to start creation, you're gonna need, you're gonna need this right here. Creation forward seven, amethyst, one blaze powder. I have one already. Uh, and you see my creations at level 30. I have one right here. Uh, creation Forge. You got a little room set up for it. This, I'm gonna put slabs in there, I think, eventually. But, oh, I should put some slabs right now. I got Corby slabs. I'm not high enough level to use Corby slabs. You see, they cost 6 creation, and then, as far as level 63 creation, I'm only level 30 creation. Uh, but no problem. We'll get there eventually. Uh, and how it works. So you start at level one, obviously. Now there's two slabs you can get at level one, and uh, the first one being, let's see if I can just spot it right here. Uh, penguin slab costs six creation, requires one. So six creation to summon it, but uh, level one requirement for the actual creation skill to use it. Four snowballs around the empty slab, very really, uh, very basic. And then the other one is draggy slab. I haven't made this one yet. Uh, three purple dive blah, blah blah. Same thing as the penguin. Cost five. Requires one. Actually, this one costs six. Uh, should I make one right now? I don't really have a use. Let's make a. Let's try and make a draggy one. Purple dye. Do I even have eggs? I don't. Oh yeah, I do. Purple dye. Purple dye. How do we make purple dye? Blue and red. Don't have red. Uh, so yeah, we'll make this just because I haven't seen this one yet. Now there's a bunch of other slab slab uh, minions or I don't even know what they're really called creation minions I guess from that look like uh, draggy here the shady waggy uh, blizzard blizzard uh, I actually have one at one of my quarries my ender quarry that's it did I ever mention I built an ender quarry I built an ender quarry just because it's way better than the regular quarry but uh, the regular quarries are easier to make ender quarry takes a lot to make I have a shady NPC and I have him set as a chunk loader. So he loads chunks for me while I'm not there. While the quarry's going off. Yo, there is zero flower. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Give me these flowers. Thanks. That, there's a floating mushroom here. I'm going to do more with this. You know what happened here? One of those bomb carriers just kept on blowing up. And I heard him. And I'm like, what is that noise? I'm hearing explosions. And I thought to myself, oh, it has to be one of those bomb carriers. I go over there. I can't find the bomb carrier, so I leave it alone. I come back, half of the half of my area is blown up. God damn, I need more. Ugh. Okay, we'll run out here. Wait, okay, yeah, we'll run out here. Beat some watcher. Hello? Oh! Spooks! That's so spooky. Get out of here. Okay. Uh, yeah, and it just he blew up my area, and I was like, wow, this is fun. Thanks, man. But uh, I'll make something out of it. That or I'll fill it in. I don't know. I want to expand, I guess, my living area. Oh, 
What the heck? I want to expand my living area to over here. Uh, I definitely want to have, as you see, I'm growing tea here. I definitely want to have more plants to grow. Because, uh, something in the future that deals with pleasing a specific god. And, uh, you'll see. I haven't explained that to Dakota yet. Just because we're, I don't think we're anywhere. And we might be somewhat close enough to start doing stuff with that. But, uh, for now, we're just not gonna worry about stuff like that. We're not gonna worry about pleasing gods over that ancient cavern. And, uh, we're just gonna live a life. Can I use these to make seeds? I can. So let's take two of them. And let's eat these two. So, I'll just summon in a dragon. Wow, look at it. And it uses the five creation. I'm pretty sure your creation doesn't regen until the minion is gone. Let's see, we got draggy here. And uh, now, you get these two level one, one, level one uh, slabs. Sorry if I'm making a lot of noise. Uh, you get one of them. Uh, probably the penguin. Penguin's a lot easier to make, but I think draggy might actually give you more in creation. Now, the creation forge is not actually used for making the slabs. As you see, they all have their recipe and just like a regular crafting table. You use the forge to level up your creation. So you take slabs and watch my uh, creation thing. See, it goes up slowly. Obviously, when you're a lower level, it it's a lot faster. So just get like a stack of penguins or a stack of uh, draggy slabs. Prefer blue penguins. A lot easier to get, like I said. And uh, you'll be able to get that. I think I got it to like level 15 with like two stacks. Let's see if we can get a uh, draggy to help us out here. Come here, draggy. 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 All right, draggy. Thanks for the help, man. You're very helpful. Where's he at? Oh, there he is. Oh my God. This is this is something I don't like. This. <laughs> He's like broken now. His AI is just broken. But uh, I tried to show him off, okay? I tried my best. I can't kill living fun guys. Alright. Draggy have fun with that. I don't know. He's gonna be there for the rest of his life trying to kill that guy. Uh, they will despawn eventually, I believe. That's what happens. Not exactly sure. I haven't messed with them too much. Because none of the early game ones are too useful. Uh, as you see, some of these actually have special effects. Ender Carrier one might actually be useful if you don't have backpacks or anything like that. Uh, construct a servility. This one, I think, I don't know what that one does, but these later ones are definitely helpful. Goofer slab, that one just sounds cool. Uh, but one of the most helpful ones I see right now is the healing golem slab. Fairly easy to make, but look at the level for it. You need level 90 creation, and uh, it's just oh my god, level 90. That's a pretty high level. Okay, so this is what we're gonna do. Uh, I'm level 30 right now. Which one uses level 30? Ricardo's level 30. So let's make a spraggy one. God. This, uh, looks kind of, kind of, kind of hard to make. I said hard to make. It's not actually that hard. Do I have bones? with bones? I need cactus though. God. Okay, I was about to say if I didn't have bones. All right, let's run to the Ender Quarry just so I can show this off too. Uh, what's the fun thing we're gonna do? We're gonna do some deep sea diving. So this is my ender quarry. Look, I got a quarry anal here. He's just doing the chunk loading. I have to add more fuel to it. Maybe even more water. Because I have a, a water tank set up down there. With the autonomous activator and steam dynamo. But yeah, this is doing really good. So what it does, uh, instead of like a regular quarry making a big hole, it uh, just makes like a column of dirt. And then once it's done, it moves on, makes a column of dirt. And uh, it just keeps on stacking dirt blocks on top of each other until it's done. And uh, this has been getting some good stuff. I've been taking all the cobblestone out, though. And using it to make, uh... Just compressing cobblestone down, if I ever need cobblestone for anything. Hey, I don't know why these guys drop sulfur. It's kind of weird. Hey, there's Draggy in the chest. All right, you can get out of here. I don't really need you anymore. Did you oh, drop XP? I'm gonna be bugged. But, uh, hey, if you wanna farm levels, damn, you got those guys right there. Uh, all right, so we get slab. Is there another egg underneath for him? Yes, it is. Okay. Are they all... They all need eggs? Yeah. Alright. Uh, let... Ooh. Let's auto-craft. Where's auto? Here it is. Boom. Okay. So. Uh... Ooh. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, he's right here. Alright. So, we got Spraggy here. Now, let's go fight a mob that isn't, uh... Level, like, 70-something in Hunter. And, uh, let's have some fun. Come on, Spraggy. Come on. Let's go. Yeah, there you go. I'm just having troubles with the door, you know. That's no problem at all. I've been trying to work and make my area actually look nice. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll connect everything to each other sooner or later. Alright, here we go. Come here, Spraggy. Look. 
Bro, we got us, we got us a live one right here. Get that. Oh, oh. All right, they're they're pretty strong against vanilla mobs, and I think I'll have some dope episodes in the future dealing with these guys if we can summon more than one at once. Which I don't think we can. But against like mobs from the mod, they have a little bit more trouble, but they will get the work done if they have high enough health. See, that took him a while, and he lost like 27 health from that. But uh, yeah, they'll they'll fight. They'll fight to the death. They're loyal. Ow. Let's just get Spraggy. Take this guy out. Come on, Spraggy. Get him. Yeah, yeah. How much health does it cost? Seven. Oh, oh, oh. Get that, Spraggy. Woo. Spraggy with the work. But uh, okay. That's pretty much it with creation. Obviously, higher levels, they all have special abilities. Um, some of them have knockback. Corby, I don't even know what the Corby does. But uh, yeah, that's really all with creation. But let let us prepare to go deep sea diving, shall we? Should I keep these spraggy slabs? Hello? Uh, I'm not gonna. Instead, what I'm gonna do is take five of these. Okay, you can't use Corby. You can't use Corby's. Uh, see, look, Spraggy just leveled us up like a lot right there. All right, Spraggy, you can chill out if you want. All right, so let's make. What's it called? Ship. Oh, ship. There you go. So we got an armor set here, diving chest from the shipwreck mod. Now shipwrecks, we might have, we might have not even uh, did too much with it. But I don't think I recorded it. But I did get like a good bunch of loot. At least I got like my first set of rail. Not railcraft, but I first had a steel armor from railcraft from uh, going inside of a diving ship. And I also found some nets in there, some safari nets. It definitely helped a lot. Now, this armor is definitely not hard to make. Ooh, emerald. Do I even own emeralds? I do. Uh, for iron. I don't even, I don't even have iron smelted. Okay, uh, oh shit. Spraggy's annoying. Let's get some iron. Get this. So, we're gonna make this armor set really quick and, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna go deep sea diving. Okay, so let us hop in. I enchanted the armor set, added some aqua infinity and respiration to it. Pretty much buffed out this armor set. Uh, as you see, it slows us down a lot. Slowing us forward when wearing the whole armor set. But it gives you night vision. Oh god, this fucking pinches. Those dudes, we can't even fight until we're level 93. And, uh, oh, here's a ship right here. Until we're level 93 in whatever it's called. I don't know, the hunter. There you go. How did I forget that one? That one's like the most important. Still walk extremely slow because it's water. There's enchantments for that in 1.8. But uh, let's not worry about that. We can fly. And uh, we'll use our flying capabilities underwater. Ah, creepers, man. Oh, God. Did I kill it? I don't know. That one, like, vanished. Yeah, these things have some actually pretty good loot. I think this is actually the one I looted. Yeah, look. That's an axe from way at the beginning of the season. Wow, man. Look at that. That's crazy. Hey. You're dead. You're dead? Okay, the game kind of froze when I killed him. Let's, yeah, let's stay away from pinchers, though. Pinchers can be very dangerous mobs. So we're definitely not high enough level to fight them. And they actually drop really good stuff because they are level 93 hunter mobs. And uh, here's a boat right here. Look at this. Dang, there's some moss cobblestone down here. If we ever need moss cobblestone, I know where to go. Gotta watch out for those aquatic creepers, though. Those dudes are crazy. Okay. What's, oh god, see? They exploded. What's in here? What's in here? Nothing in here? What? What the heck? Oh, that's oil. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in here. Who's exploding? Was that actually a creeper? Crazy. Crazy. I don't know what's exploding, to be honest. Oh shoot. I didn't even notice that this is here. This uh, abyssal stone. That's actually pretty dope. Get out of here. This is, this is a good way to get gunpowder, and I have been using guys to get gunpowder for something special coming up. That will definitely be the next episode. I'm going to do some F3A just to see what's exploding. I don't know, nothing really crazy is exploding. I have my render distance really low for some reason. Whatever. Uh, what the heck what kind of weapon did that guy have? Oh, God, there's pinches here. All right, we're going to have to evade these pinches when checking out this ship here. Yo, we got this OP flux infused axe. I made this recently because my axe broke. And uh, it's OP. I can empower it. And it turns it red and now it goes at like times 10 speed. But uh, we're not going to worry about that. We gotta be quiet, guys. They're here. Spooks. Spooks. 
We're gonna use the steel armor to uh, go ahead and smelt them down into steel ingots. Using the railcraft stuff. Uh, railcraft. What, what thing? I don't know. Whatever one does a smelting. Coke oven? No, it's not coke oven. It's the other one. Hey, pal. Bye. Out of here. Hey, creeper. Yeah, I've been using guys to get gunpowder and, uh, I have a really, really fun use for them. This. I don't know what happened here. These dudes are savages. Okay, look. This happened recently, too. There's some crazy aquatic creepers, man. What can I say? Uh, is there any more ships? I don't see any more ships. Huh. Weird. Okay, I guess I guess we're done with diving because this ocean is so small. Yeah, so that should uh, end off this episode. And uh, I have some ideas for this thing right here. Me and Dakota are supposed to explore it. We're going to explore it uh, and try not to destroy it because the idea I have should be really interesting. But uh, I just want to give you guys a sneak peek for what's to happen next episode. That's blood. Uh, and, uh, is, oh my god, what's going on over here? Okay, to end off the episode, we're gonna add to our gold trophy collection. Found a couple of bam bams there. I tried to record all of it, but... A lot of them were me having to go back and get like three more explosive vitals because at the end the loot would always explode because there's that one little bam hiding in the corner somewhere. But yeah, let's add them to the collection. I'm not gonna go in order how uh, how we fought them because we fought Smash first. I gotta spawn that in. Fought Smash first and then we fought all the other ones. We're just gonna go in order of how I get the gold statue. So Bam Bam's next. He will, uh, we'll put him across. Is that, that's what we'll do. Uh, do that. So if you break them with your fist, by the way, they vanish, apparently. Did not know that. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah! Perfect! 